Hello, welcome back to the channel. This video is going to show you how to play Grim Dawn without DLCs, Ashes of Mammoth and Forgotten Gods. You may be wondering why would you want to do that? Well, I had to do this last year because I um, nagged a friend of mine into getting the, the base game. And then I said, look, we'll team up and I'll you know, show you a few things, whatever. And I had to figure out how to run the game without the DLC so we could play together. And there's a very simple way of doing it. You go into Steam. This is only a guide for Steam. If you're not playing Grim Dawn on Steam, good luck. I don't know how you're going to do this. You might have the same option, you might not. You go into Steam, you right-click on the game name in the library. You go into the properties, and there is a box called Launch Options where you can type in command line parameters before which the game will pick up when it runs. To run the game without launching Ashes of Mammoth DLC, you put the launch parameter in forward slash NOGDX1, and to play without Forgotten Gods, you put forward slash NOGDX2. And if you want to run without both of them, you just put both the parameters in with a space separating them. Now, I'll, I'll put these parameters in the description so you can copy and paste them out if you don't, can't rely on looking at the screen or how I'm pronouncing these letters. But that's it. You, this won't uninstall the DLC. That's very, very important. It does not uninstall it. All it does is it launches the game without running the DLC. So you can put these parameters in and take them out and you can run the game with or without the DLC. So here's some video of me after I've put in both parameters and then I've put one back in and then the other back in. And the only thing that's missing from this is me quitting out of the game, changing the parameters and going back in again. It's literally this quick. This is Grim Dawn running with both those parameters. So it's not running, it's not loading the Ashes of Mammoth DLC or the Forgotten Gods. And the reason why there's no characters showing is because the, the characters that have been affected by items or anything from the DLC won't appear in the vanilla game. So you can't, you can't load a level 100 character, obviously, because the, the base game level cap was 85. And if you've got any items that came from either of the expansion packs, then those items don't exist in the, in the universe of the, the vanilla, of the vanilla game. I can't say vanilla, the universe of the vanilla game. So you, you, yeah, so I have got no characters that match the vanilla game, so I have to create a new one and take that character in. And then I'll apply Ashes of Malmuth, so you can see it running around in Ashes of Malmuth DLC, but it can't, but I'll just show you the map. And then I'll do the same with Forgotten Gods. Give you a good price of what I've got left. See you around. You can see from looking at the map here, there's no Forgotten Gods area. If I scroll up, there's no Gloomwald. There's no Ashes of Malmoth. Those places don't exist yet. Just a figment of my future memory. I'll just quickly level this character up so you can see the mastery selection screen and the full retro list of six masteries. There you go, that was all we had back in the day, but that was more than enough. There were fewer constellations on the devotion screen as well, in the base game. Right, all you're not seeing here is me quitting out of the game, going into the launch options and removing one of the parameters so that we reinstate the Ashes of Malmoth DLC. As I said, nothing's been uninstalled, nothing's being reinstalled. Here 
Here you can see on the map that the Ashes of Mammoth locations are now there. Now I'll quit out of the game, remove the other parameter from the launch options, so I'll reinstate the Forgotten Gods DLC and restart the game. Now you can see with both the DLCs reinstated, all, all my old characters are back, which is good. I mean, it's, it's kind of scary for a while when there's nobody there on the roster and you're thinking, you know, there's thousands and thousands of hours down the drain. Well, they're down the drain anyway, because playing video games is a complete and utter waste of time. You shouldn't be doing it. Do something constructive with your life. But hey, here we go. So we go back in, and you can see that all is well with the world. All the DLCs are there, fully functional. All that's left to do is quit out, delete this character, and go and get myself a life.